feels like rendezvous You know what to do Keep your love for me only I get high on you Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a haul for you guys. It's from two different stores. I was gonna call it a collective haul, but like it's only two stores, so it's not really a collective haul. Um, I ended up ordering a bunch of stuff from Torrid, and also I ordered a couple of things from American Eagle. But the American Eagle stuff wasn't enough to like make its own haul, so I figured I would just add it together, and hopefully you guys don't mind. So I'm gonna talk about American Eagle stuff first, just because there's less of them, so I figured I'd just get it out of the way first. Um, I ordered two pairs of jeans and also two sweaters. The first pair of jeans I ordered are the Curvy Super High Rise Jegging in just this light wash with no distressing. I just wanted a couple of pairs of jeans that didn't have any distressing because, you know, I love distressed denim, like literally love it. That's all I really wear. Um, but sometimes I feel like you just need a clean non-distressed pair of jeans so i ordered two pairs of those from american eagle again this one is in a light wash i have it in a size 22. i like these they fit really well kind of wanting to distress the knee because i just i live for distressed jeans and i feel like just like splitting the knee would be so cute like not too much distressing but like just a little split knee i don't know we'll see so yeah i ordered these in a size 22 and they were originally 40 dollars. i believe they had a, a buy one get one half off sale and that's why i bought two pairs i can't remember why um but here's the tag the second pair that i got didn't actually fit which was kind of surprising to me because i stuck with that curvy super high res jegging style um because i actually have a pair of jeans from there which you will see me try on the tops with and they're the curvy super high rise jegging and they fit fine they're actually like on the bigger side like i feel like I'm like in between a 22 and 20 in those so I ordered a 22 in these and they did not fit like you guys will see that I needed a, like a size up for sure um, but they're just a dark pair of denim no distressing again ordered these in a 22 and they were $49.95 so I am going to return these because obviously they just did not fit for me So like I said, I do love the American Eagle jeans that I own. However, I do think that they're kind of trying to get their sizing consistent because clearly there are still some inconsistencies. Now I'll show you the pair that I have already that I didn't, like that I already previously owned. Um, I did haul these. Did I haul these? Not sure if I hauled these or not. My mom actually bought these for me because she had... Uh, there was like a day when it was like buy one get one free and she's like i don't need two pairs so she bought me one pair and so she bought me the curvy again where is it the curvy super high rise jegging in a size 22 these fit me perfectly um and they have distressing on the leg on both sides so these are the jeans that i ended up trying on a majority of the torrid tops with just because these are my jeans and they fit me perfectly and I just did um okay now for the sweaters that i got both of these sweaters are super soft and super comfortable the first one has got to be my favorite because it's literally like butter on the skin it's that like chenille i believe it's called chenille um and it's super soft super soft love this nude color turtleneck now american eagle does not carry their tops and sweaters and things like that in plus sizes however their 2x typically fits um, in a couple of different things like so in oversized sweaters for sure You're probably gonna be able to fit a 2x if you're a true 3x. I would say like anywhere from a 20 to a 24 small 26 would probably fit the American Eagle double XL sweaters and oversized tops and things of that nature So I picked up this one again. It's the chenille nice little like blushy nude color that I'm obsessed with um, it is it does have a, a little bit of detailing here at the sleeve and then it has some side slits which is going to be hard there you go see it has some side slits there it's just super comfy and like i just want this fabric on my body at all times it's so cozy so yeah pick this up this one is in an xxl and it says it was 60 dollars, but again i got it on sale did not spend 60 dollars on this and then the last thing I got from American Eagle was another sweater. This one is not really my jam. I just feel like it's a little bit too shapeless. Like, 
like I love oversized but for some reason this one just it's not oversized nicely on my body um, but it is again another like nude color turtleneck this turtleneck is shorter I would consider it a mock neck um, and it's just a nice chunky knit oversized sweater really comfortable just not my favorite I may return this one as well where's the tag here it is so yeah I got it in an XXL and it says that it was $50 again did not pay that so that's all I ended up getting from American Eagle now let's move on to Torrid I ended up picking up a lot of different intimates just because a lot of my bras are kind of like old and a lot of them have lost the underwire and I just keep wearing them because they're like my favorite bras and they're so comfortable and but my like and so I just keep wearing them but literally my boobs are like sagging to the ground in them because there's no underwire and it's just like no support at all so I decided I needed to pick up a couple of new bras I love torrid bras like that is the only place that I get my bras from I am obsessed like would highly recommend them literally the only place I get my bras from I love their push-up bras their t-shirt bras they have uh, bralettes with underwire love I love their strapless bras their racer back bras literally every single bra I love it is I just love them so I picked up two of them these happen to be in clearance always check the clearance section they typically always have bras Another thing I like is that I have a wide back and a smaller cup. Um, so my bra size is a 48C. And so it, it can be kind of difficult to find that size because it's a wide band and small cup. Um, but this is a push-up plunge bra. I just thought this was gorgeous. Again, I love this like romantic blush color with that little accent of lace. Loved that. This one was on clearance, so I don't know the exact price of it. I will link everything in the description box down below that I can find. But this one, the tag says $54.90. I believe it was somewhere around $20 um, for this bra. The next bra I picked up was, again, another 48C in a nude color. I just like nude bras because... I don't really have to worry about you seeing them when I'm wearing white. And you guys know that I like to wear a lot of light colors. So I picked up this one. This is the push-up t-shirt bra. And again, in the size 48C. Love it. There's a decent amount of padding in both of them. Um, and they just make your boobs look pretty good. And you really don't get a lot of like over spillage on the side. So I appreciate that. Again, this one's in a 48C. And this one says it was $52.90. Again, it was in clearance. So I believe it was somewhere around the $20 mark. I have to say that I am so impressed with this one pair of underwear like so impressed another thing about me I only wear torrid underwear like that's literally the only thing I have in my drawer is torrid underwear like I love them so I saw these online and I'm always looking for like a shaping underwear you guys know I like shapewear I just do I wear it every single day I can do an updated shapewear video if you guys want that from me but I typically wear pretty cheap shapewear like the one I was wearing today was from Kmart I have one from Target uh, one from Marshalls like just pretty cheap I, I don't feel like you have to spend too much money on different shapewear anyways I was online looking at the underwear and they had these high-waisted thongs and they're like smoothing a little bit if you can see this panel right here there's like a little bit of smoothing in it and it's nothing too crazy it's just a light smoothing but I like that it was a thong back because if you guys know anything about like shaping underwear, they typically are briefs and you can typically see the line unless you're wearing like um, a thigh shaper type of garment. So I love these, like love. I was wearing these actually when I was trying the clothes on for you guys in this try on and I, I'm so impressed. Like I want to go buy a million other pairs. I want to wear these every single day. They're so comfortable and so just like smoothing. Lightly though. <laughs> um... So I got these in a size three and they were $20.90. Totally worth it. 100% obsessed with them. Like if you like shapewear, light shapewear, just like everyday kind of light shapewear, pick these up. They're amazing. I don't know if you're going to be able to see the tag. There you go. Obsessed with those. To go along with that, I picked up a high waist, sexy, smoothing short. Um, th these are good for dresses if you want to like smooth out your thighs. Typically, I really don't care about the lower half of my body like my thighs that kind of, basically just my thighs I don't really care about smoothing that out um, that being said I have a wedding to go to in a couple of months and I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna be wearing and so I figured I'd pick these up and give them a try again they're super light shaping as far as shapewear goes it's not gonna like totally change the shape of your body it's not gonna like you know make you look like you have no stomach 
but it just kind of gives you a smoother silhouette so again i picked these up in a size three and they are a little leg shaper these ones were $24.90. And then my favorite underwear of all time from Toriad are these little like lacy, cheeky underwear. These are basically all I wear. That's probably TMI, but I'm obsessed with these kinds of underwear. They just lay on your body so nicely. They're nice and thick. They don't roll up. They don't roll down. They just sit where you place them. And I love that. So yeah, these are the black lace cheekies from Toriad. I have like six pairs of black lace cheekies. I just think they're sexy and just like cute and yeah I didn't try these on obviously because I am not trying to be demonetized but yeah this one pair of underwear I got in a size 4 and were $16.90 you can always get these on a sale I believe they always have some sort of sale going on it's like buy three get one free or buy something like that some sale always um but yeah here's the tag and then I just picked up the same thing but in this like lilac -y gray color because I thought it was pretty and have a bralette that matches it so pick those up same thing size 4 $16.90 same thing okay on to the clothes now I only picked up about four items of clothing but I also picked up four pairs of shoes now <laughs> I'm somebody who shoes and me are not best friends like I really have a hard time with shoes you guys know I had ankle surgery and if you don't know Hello, I had ankle surgery when I was a senior in high school. I ended up shattering both sides of my ankles, tore, well, both sides of my left ankle, tore all the ligaments and um, tendons that were in there. And so I have like permanent screws, rods, and plates keeping everything together. So my left ankle is always a little bit bigger than my right side, making my left foot a little bit wider than my right side. So I just feel like I have kind of a hard time finding shoes that fit me properly and on top of that I just have wide feet like I just have wide feet so Tory shoes typically always fit me pretty well so I always get them from there but moving on to the clothes I picked up two little like satiny tanks and I feel like I may want to exchange them for a size smaller sorry guys I'm having a bad hair day I don't know what's happening here um but I feel like I may want to exchange these for a size smaller I picked up this tank which is a really nice like mustard yellow color with black lace detailing and some black stripes vertical stripes going down black and white and then it has faux buttons going all the way down the tank i bought these solely for the purpose of tucking them in to high-waisted jeans and wearing with like a cute cardigan and making like a cute fall outfit um and i feel like i definitely should have got a size three because they are pretty big so i might be exchanging these for a size three if i can um so yeah i got these in a four and they were 38.90 it was $38.90. And I also picked this one up. This one is my favorite just because of the color. I just, I love this color. Again, you guys know this. I just love these like soft, blushy, neutral, mauve colors. So pretty. Same thing with the black lace and the buttons going all the way down. Um, again, we'll try to exchange these for a size three. The next thing I picked up because it just looked so comfy and cute is this little pink Henley peplum top. It's just this really pretty baby pink color and it's so soft. It's like that waffle knitted, waffle knitted Henley style top. The buttons are functioning there at the top and it's just so comfy. Like this, again, is one of those fabrics that you want on your body at all times because it's just so cozy. Like, oh, it's so soft. So I picked this one up in a size three and it was $42.90. I also picked up just a white crew neck t-shirt you guys know i love white this one is a little bit off white um, if you can see the difference between the shirt i'm wearing and this t-shirt it's a little bit more like cream off white color which i don't mind obviously for the winter season coming up it is that like soft hangy drapey fabric which i kind of wish it was more of like a cotton fabric um but again don't mind got it in a size three it's nothing there's nothing really to it it's just a a plain white t-shirt and it was $28.90 and the last piece of clothing that I got from Torrid is a sweater this style comes out every single year from a bunch of different retailers and I always want one and I never get it so I figured I'd pick it up for myself um, it is a red and black buffalo plaid sweater this one is a nice it's almost like a fuzzy knit it's not really but it I don't know it's a little bit itchy like it's got that like 
wool kind of feel to it. Um, it is a heavier weighted cardigan and it does have button closures that look like this, if you can see that. It is a nice length, I like the length on it. It's a really, it's a cute sweater. Like it really is a really cute fall, winter, cozy sweater. So I picked this up. This one was definitely more pricey. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it because it was pricey, uh, but I got it in a four and it was $78.90, which $80 for a sweater is a little expensive. So I may return this and see if I can find a more affordable option, maybe Target or Old Navy, but we'll see. Got it in a four. Or $78.90. And let's talk about shoes. I got two pairs of boots. Well, one pair of boots, a pair of booties, and two pairs of like little mule slide type things. Um, let's talk about the boots first. Every year, Tord comes out with a whole new selection of like over the knee boots or thigh high boots or something like that. And I personally love over the knee boots. I just think they're so chic, so cute. Easy way to dress up an outfit. That's really cute. So I picked up a brown pair. These ones are a pair of brown faux leather boots and I like that they have a stretch panel in the back because my calves are huge. Now, these are wide calf to begin with, but I definitely need the little bit of extra room that a stretch panel will provide. So yeah, they are super cute. Look like that when they're on. There's a nice faux leather brown boot for the winter time. These ones I got in a size 11 and they were $84.90. Again, there was some sort of sale. I think everything was 30% off on the website when I purchased them, but yes, love these. The next pair of shoes I got were these little brown booties. I just thought these were super cute as well. They have two zippers, one is functioning, one is just for looks and it's just cute. Like I just thought these were a really cute fall little tan booty. It's a faux suede booty nice little like no heels it's not flat but well actually do you consider these flat i consider this like a little it's flat basically <laughs> i mean it does give you maybe like an inch and a half of height difference but it's basically flat so it's an everyday type of shoe super cute loved these got these in a size 11 and they were 59.90 and then the last two pairs of shoes that i have to show you probably are my favorite i just love mules like i just think mules are so cute i love them in the summer i love them in the winter i love them in the fall love them in the, i literally just love mules they're so cute so the first pair i picked up were these snakeskin printed mules like how cute are these i just i love them it's got like an almond toe shape right here just a nice mule just, I can't even say anything more about it. It's just so cute. Like you need these, everybody needs these. They're in a nice neutral snake print. So you can literally wear this with anything you want to basically. So cute, love them. And then I also picked them up in the black color because again, who doesn't need a black pair of mules? So love these, so cute. I got both of these pairs of shoes in a size 11 and they were $39.90 each pair. All right guys, so those were the last items of this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know where you want to see a haul from next in the comment section down below so I know where to shop from. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.